Hey everyone, this is Larry with Today I Feel Like. Today we are gonna take a look at the Sigma 18 to 50 millimeter F2.8 lens for Fuji X mount. So we're gonna talk about the performance and some of the features. We're gonna take a look at some samples. So let's jump right in and here we go. First off, let's talk about the design and the build quality of this lens. The Sigma 18 to 50 2.8 has solid construction, it's compact, it's lightweight, and it's dust and splash resistance, which makes it really great for shooting outdoors. Now let's delve in and talk about a couple of the key features with this lens, and one of them is that it is a zoom lens that goes from 18 to 50 millimeters or 27 to 75 millimeters in 35 millimeter equivalent, and it has a 2.8 constant aperture all the way through the zoom range. So you're gonna be able to get that nice consistent background blur and bokeh, whether you're shooting a landscape or shooting a portrait on the long end of the zoom. Well, we know this lens is lightweight and compact and has a 2.8 constant aperture, but what about image quality? Well, this lens delivers sharp and high quality images with minimal distortion and chromatic aberrations, and to give you a taste of what it can do, let me go ahead and show you some sample images. Now let's talk about autofocus and video performance. And for all of you videographers out there, the Sigma 18 to 50 2.8 also shines. It boasts a fast and quiet autofocusing system, making it perfect for both photography and video recording. No worries about noisy focusing motors. This thing is going to be quiet while you're filming. All right, so wrapping things up, I have to say that the Sigma 18 to 50 millimeter F2.8 for Fuji X mount is a fantastic lens. It's lightweight, it's compact, it has really sharp image quality, it has fast silent autofocusing for you videographers. It really is just an all around great lens and I can't recommend it highly enough. The only thing that I think it's missing is image stabilization in the lens. But if you're shooting with a body like the X-T5, then you have image stabilization in your camera. You don't have to worry about having it in the lens itself. So yeah, there you go. Anyways, I'm gonna leave a link to this down below in the video description so that you can check it out. I'll also leave links to my Amazon page and my social media contacts so you can reach me elsewhere. And I hope you enjoyed seeing this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. And I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.